Welcome to today's video. Today we'll be looking at the Olight Diffuse and seeing if it's good enough to be in your EDC. So I was interested in this light as soon as I saw it for two unique features. One is its form factor and two is its ability to take any AA batteries. So we look in the package, we're gonna get the light, the manual, charging cable, and a lanyard. If we look at the light, it's roughly uh, three and a fourth inches long, which is also 87 millimeters. Its width or diameter is roughly three quarters of an inch or 19 millimeters. It does have a unique pentagonal shape, which is really nice because it makes it so it will not roll off your desk. It does have a side switch. It will tail stand. Long pressing will go to moonlight mode, uh, which is one lumen and will run for 180 hours. Low is 10 lumen and will run for 25 hours. Medium is 50 lumen and will run for seven hours. And high is 350 lumens for 10 minutes then it'll step down to 150 lumens for 120 minutes. Turbo is 700 lumen for one minute and 350 lumens for 70 minutes. The light does also have a strobe mode accessible via triple clicking. The light will remember the last mode you were in besides turbo or strobe. So if we're going to low, turn it off. Turn it back on, you see. Now the power indicator will be green if it's 60 to 100% full, orange if it's 15 to 60%, and anything under 15% will be red. The light does also have a lockout mode. If you long press and continue to hold through moonlight mode, you'll see the light will go uh, red. Holding again for a until moonlight mode comes on, we'll turn that off. One of the most interesting options for this light is its AA battery handling. So if we look at the battery that's included, it includes a 920 milliamp, 3.6 volt customized Olight battery, but it will accept any other AA batteries. So here I have a 1.5 volt double-A uh, battery. Long pressing will also give you moonlight mode again. Long pressing again, you will get a low, a medium, and a high uh, with any double-A battery, but the power indicator will always be red. Now, if we compare it to the i5R, you'll see that it is just a little bit shorter. It is just slightly larger in diameter. It will tail stand. And obviously this is the diffuse is missing the, the pocket clip, but I think that's one of its great benefits of being a different type of light. I find it's great to keep in a sling bag or in my backpack as a secondary light. The included battery can be recharged using the included USB cable. So the, will, the battery will charge at five volts at up to one amp. It will take about two hours to go uh, from empty to full. I do really like the Olight Diffuse. Kind of the features I like the most are that it's, uh, its shape doesn't allow it to roll. I do like that it has a side switch. I do like that it tail stands, that it accepts all AA batteries. And I find it as a secondary light, either in my sling bag or in my backpack. I do carry it a lot to sporting events because my normal EDC light, the Arcfeld Pro, is not allowed into sporting events because of the laser. So if you're looking for a small, compact, bright EDC flashlight, I highly recommend the Olight Diffuse. If you'd like to watch my Arcfeld Pro review, 
please click the video here.